hey guys tuli over here and welcome back to another vlog you guys i did so much cooking this morning but i will explain to you why i was doing the cooking anyway i just absolutely absolutely love this knife it cuts the cabbage to precision you guys just look at how it slices if you don't have this knife in your house you definitely need to invest in it because it is amazing it is so amazing so i'm just about to make some coleslaw salad like i said there's a lot of cooking going on because we have like a cultural event that i will explain later on in the video but um i shredded up that cabbage so nicely it took me less than 10 minutes to get this coleslaw salad done and yeah guys just look at that look at that you get it right every single time you get it absolutely right and I also just um, grated in some apples um, sprinkled a bit of sugar sprinkled a bit of salt and then I mixed in the mayonnaise um, as I was about to serve, which was like maybe two hours later. So yeah, that is just what I'm doing over here. With clean hands, I mixed up that salad and I prefer using my hands. As long as they clean, I prefer using my hands. Um, I've got the rice on the stove. I've got the chicken boiling on the side. You guys, I first boil my chicken before I fry it. I'm just wired that way. So that is what I'm doing. And it came out huh, absolutely, absolutely divine. And I did not go to cook school, you guys. Uh, this, this was just something I was doing from my head, you guys. This was just something I was just doing from my head. I boiled up some potatoes, sprinkled some turmeric and fried them up so that they would be like really golden brown. Ha! Huh, I give myself a 10 out of 10. The food looked and tasted amazing. I then went on to do a beef stew with green beans in it and that beef was just so amazing. I had to look I had to look fresh first before before <laughs> There's baby's mommy There's Misty there's Mickey. Yeah, we're having the event for her, baby. If you didn't watch our video where we, um, when she got married, check it out over here and watch it. And yeah, so a cute baby is now around. Look at that smile. Yes, yes. Uh, say hi, guys. So it's just a tiny event, you guys. I'll just let you know what's going on as it is happening. Finally, finally done cooking. Thank you, Jesus. And don't mind my hair. I'm going to wear a wig. Let me introduce the fam before the in-laws come. Dabby, come. There's my tete. Come. Who is YouTube? Ah, <laughs> there's my tete, my husband's first sister, older sister, and just a sweet baby. Here's a baby who's getting everything done. Come. And another come. cute baby. Come, come. Come, I take a picture. Come, come yeah. and say cheese. Sit, sit with tete. Good. Sit yeah. with tete, take a picture. So the process goes like this. When a woman has given birth to her first child, she is sent back to her father's house, you know, so that the mother can teach her how to take care of a baby and everything. Um, so after about two months, um, the in-laws then come to collect um, their daughter-in-law from the father's house. So this is just the process that was happening. Um, and 
yeah we just started with a word of worship you know um songs of worship just to thank the lord for the gift of life that we had been given um and it was such a beautiful event so what this girl's auntie does is that um she takes the baby and then the in-laws come with gifts of money of uh, clothes of blankets for the baby and once those gifts are presented to the baby um the girl's auntie can then hand over the baby to his grandfather so that is just what was happening we were just so excited so happy oh i had forgotten they also come with a chicken and this is the chicken that we all slaughter and eat together and be merry with and they also bring milly meal as well it is just um beautiful you guys culture is just beautiful it brings families together poor baby didn't know what was going on you guys look at how cute he is he just didn't know what was going on so he's then handed over to his father's people and yeah we ate we were merry we enjoyed ourselves that is just the process that was going on and in our language this is called kutara <laughs> I just placed the food round the table. Let me give you a tip. The easiest thing you can do when you've got guests is let them serve themselves. So just dish out the food put it on the table and people serve themselves it's so easy you guys it's so much easy but anyway look at that food look at that food i give myself so much props hey guys so it's the next day it's a sunday and you see me smiling but you guys i am tired i am tired i've got a headache and yeah right now because i got the opportunity to leave the girls at home with their aunt um i'm just going to a friend's garage sale she's having a garage sale in the hood so i'm just going to see what they have if i can get anything you know i'm a thrifter you guys know i'm a thrifter all through and through so i'm just going over to her place to see what's there and if i buy something i'll buy something but you guys are definitely coming along with me so let's go you guys let's go because i need to come back home like in a short while so let's go longest longest you are around at least you like getting rid of stuff. Yeah. Me, I don't get rid of you, you <laughs> order. I'm the order. <laughs> <laughs> How much do we have? Yeah. What do we have? What are we getting what rid of? Look, 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 look. Mumba menu. <laughs> I'm the type of person who when you support me i want to support you back so um this lady is my client as well she comes and gets her hair done by me so when she posted her post for a garage sale i was like i'm definitely going to support her so she had a whole lot of mix of household items clothing shoes um curtains uh very beautiful stuff very beautiful stuff but i was just looking for a few things in particular because hubby had already given me a warning not to spend too much money so yeah i went there with a budget and it worked out because i found 
what I was looking for. I got um, this beautiful spice holder and those spice racks go for like $30 and I managed to snag it for $3. So I was really happy about that. But um, this is just the overview of everything that she had on sale. The previous week she had um, a sale as well. So this was the stuff that had remained. Um, there were also some kids games, um, adult games. Yeah, a whole mixture of stuff. May I put a candle in this thing? One second. Ah. Candle holder. That opens. Ah. Candle holder. That opens. I'm back home now, and this is just what I ended up getting. <clears throat> My voice. She gave me these spring onions just for giving me. So I got this fruit bowl because I don't have a fruit bowl. So I got this. Miss T is helping me. And I got this top. got this top, yeah. this pair of shorts, um, another trousers for Miss Mickey. You, why are you closing the window? So this goes with this. This goes inside of this, like this. But I want to use it as a fruit bowl. Um, I got a grinder. I got this um, grinder. I'm just going to put it in some coarse salt. Mama, Mama. I got these makeup Mama. bags. One is for me, one is for Miss Mickey. Yay. So I'll just clean them. Put this away, Mickey, because Mama. put it in the kitchen and wash them. And I also got this spice rack. Do you like this? We show the people. Hi, hi, The spice rack. Mommy. I also got that. It's got Mommy. one, two, three, four, five, six. Mommy. Yeah. So I Mommy. believe this was a good deal.